All my life, I have been a man of peace, working for peace, striving for peace, negotiating for peace. A Marvellous Year for Plums by Hugh Whitemore. It's a great big epic history play in the tradition of the Shakespearean history play. And I am still that same man with the same convictions and the same devotion to peace. I could not be other, even if I were. Anthony Eden, the Prime Minister, is really the tragic hero of the play. And what Hugh has done, I, I think most movingly, is get completely inside the skin of all his characters, no matter where they sit on the historical spectrum. It was jealousy made me realise. Hugh Gateskill, the leader of the Labour Party, is Eden's mighty opposite in the play, and again, a man of sharp contrasts. I loved you, and I wanted you to love me, me alone. Nobody else allowed, not even in the past. He is both a man of high integrity, fiercely opposed to the war, but also he's romantically involved with a married woman. Was that the man you loved? I didn't love. Anne Fleming was an extraordinary figure. She seemed to know absolutely everybody, and it's that mixture of rather daring sexuality and, and extraordinary aristocratic connections that binds together a lot of the strands in the play. And it's a great, big, romantic, sexy, sad, moving, humane, compassionate political epic. Mm -hmm.